32 Saluki facts every owner should know. Number 1. One of the oldest dog breeds, the Saluki is a medium to large sized canine. Adult males generally stand 23 to 28 inches tall, with females a bit smaller at 21 to 26 inches. On average, these dogs weigh between 40 and 65 pounds. Number 2. Distinguishing a Saluki is effortless thanks to its distinctive appearance characterized by long narrow heads and slightly arched skulls. The tapered muzzle adds to their elegant look, while large dark and expressive eyes enhance the Saluki's gentle and intelligent demeanor. Number 3. One of the most characteristic features of Salukis is their long pendulous ears. These ears are set low and hang close to the head, framing their face beautifully. When the Saluki is in motion, these ears flow back, enhancing their overall appearance of speed and grace. Number 4. The Saluki is well recognized for its graceful and balanced appearance, featuring two coat types, smooth and feathered. The feathered variety stands out with light fluffing on the legs, thighs, ears, and throat. Both coats are silky and don't shed much compared to some other dog breeds. Number 5. These dogs boast a short and fine coat, available in various colors such as cream, fawn, red, grizzle, tan, tricolor, black and tan, and white. Some Salukis showcase longer hair on their ears, tail, and legs, adding an even greater touch of majesty to their appearance. Number 6. The breed has a long, curved tail with long hair, making it look graceful. They usually keep their tails low, but when they're excited or on the move, it's carried high, making them look even more elegant. Number 7. These dogs are also well known for their effortless and flowing gait, moving in a manner that is both smooth and graceful. It resembles the sleek movements of a cat, highlighting their remarkable athleticism and grace. Number 8. The breed standard mandates a dignified and gentle expression in these dogs. Following the AKC standard, their eyes should be dark to hazel, presenting a deep, faithful, and far-seeing look. Number 9. According to Stanley Korn's book, The Intelligence of Dogs, Salukis rank 43rd out of 79 dog breed groups in terms of obedience and intelligence. Teaching them requires patience, as they may need 25 to 40 repetitions to grasp a new command. Typically, they get common commands right 50% of the time on the first try. Number 10. Training Salukis can pose a challenge because of their independent nature. They are not always eager to please and can be a bit stubborn, earning them comparisons to cats in terms of independence. Achieving success with these elegant dogs requires a consistent approach, recognizing and respecting their unique traits. Number 11. Gentle and friendly. Salukis are quick to befriend anyone, ruling them out as guard dogs. Instead, they shine as watchdogs, alerting owners with natural vigilance. These aloof dogs don't bark much, so when they do bark, it's a sign that something might be amiss. Number 12. With a heritage as a hunting dog, Salukis have a strong instinct to chase fast and furry objects. When they spot such things, they tend to chase without heeding commands to stop or return. They also don't pay much attention to their surroundings during a chase, so you gotta keep your Saluki on a leash or in a securely fenced area when outside to prevent potential accidents. Number 13. These sighthounds are one of the fastest dog breeds in the world, capable of impressive speeds ranging from 30 to 35 miles per hour. Some breeders even claim they can reach speeds as high as 50 miles per hour. Number 14. On average, these wonderful dogs tend to live around 12 to 14 years, and thankfully, they are typically free from any significant genetic health issues. With proper care and affection, many can enjoy fulfilling and longer lives. Number 15. Unlike many dog breeds, Salukis don't often have genetic diseases. However, they could face concerns such as anesthesia sensitivity due to their lean body mass with a very small fat percentage. Other potential issues include hemangiosarcoma, cardiomyopathy, and hypothyroidism similar to other dog breeds. Number 16. In a 2006 breed-specific survey by the Kennel Club and the British Small Animal Veterinary Association, the main cause of death for the Saluki was identified as cancer, accounting for 35.6% of cases. The most common types reported were liver cancer and lymphoma. Number 17. The same 2006 survey revealed that approximately 17.2% of these dogs succumbed to heart problems, including heart failure and unspecified heart defects, making it the second leading cause of death. Skin conditions like dermatitis and alopecia were also reported in 10.8% of cases. Number 18. Once known as the Persian Greyhound or the Gazelle Hound, the Saluki has long been considered one of the most ancient dog breeds, and recent genetic evidence confirms this belief. Scientists speculate that Saluki 
Saluki is another ancient breed descent from the first ever dogs traveling the world with their nomadic owners. Number 19. The origin of the breed's name, Saluki, is still uncertain. It might be derived from the ancient Yemeni city of Saluk, or possibly from the Syrian city of Seleukia. Another theory suggests that it could be a transliteration of the Arabic word for a hound. Number 20. Depiction of dogs resembling Salukis, featuring a greyhound-like body and distinctive featherings on the ears, tails, and legs, date back to Egyptian tombs around 2100 BCE, approximately 4,000 years ago. Going even further back in time, carvings from Sumerian Empire from 7,000 to 6,000 BCE showcase dogs that strikingly resemble the Saluki. Number 21. Salukis held high esteem among Egyptian nobles and were particularly favored by pharaohs, the rulers of ancient Egypt. These dogs were occasionally mummified, much like pharaohs themselves, and preserved Saluki bodies have even been discovered in tombs along the Upper Nile. Number 22. Nomadic Muslims, who typically regarded dogs as unclean animals, considered Salukis a special gift from Allah and referred to them as the honorific El Hor, meaning the noble. This breed held a unique status, being the only dogs permitted to sleep inside the tents. Number 23. Legend has it that returning crusaders introduced Saluki-type dogs from the Middle East to Europe. Following the breed's arrival on the continent, renowned artists such as Lucas Cranach the Elder and Paolo Veronese depicted dogs resembling Salukis in their artworks. Number 24. The Saluki was introduced to Britain in 1840, but it wasn't until after the First World War that the breed gained popularity in Great Britain. British officers who had served in the Middle East brought Salukis back with them, marking a significant turning point for the breed in the Western world. Number 25. These dogs faced near extinction in the West during the Second World War. The outbreak of the war led to a halt in breeding and show activities. Some owners, fearing the consequences of war, went to extremes, euthanizing entire kennels to prevent the dogs from dying of starvation or being harmed by bombings. Number 26. The recognition and popularity of the breed in the Western world started to grow in the late 19th and early 20th centuries when Florence Amherst, the daughter of the first Baron Amherst of Hackney, imported a pair of these dogs to England from the kennels of Prince Abdullah in 1895. Number 27. Salukis didn't receive much initial interest in the United States. However, their popularity soon skyrocketed, leading to the establishment of the Saluki Club of America in 1927. The first Saluki registered by the AKC, Giniet of Greville, was recorded in 1929. Number 28. These dogs have garnered a special love from people worldwide and have maintained a stable popularity in the U.S. According to the American Kennel Club's list of the most popular dog breeds in the United States, Salukis secured 135th position out of 199 breeds, based on the total number of registrations nationwide. Number 29. Getting a Saluki puppy can be quite expensive. On average, Saluki puppies with common lineage are priced at about $2,500. However, if you decide to get a Saluki from a well-known breeder, expect a higher price ranging from $3,500 to $5,000 per puppy or even higher. Number 30. In 1996, the Guinness Book of World Records recognized the Saluki as the fastest dog, reaching a speed of 42.8 miles per hour. This exceptional speed is attributed to the breed's heavily padded feet, which absorb the impact on the dog's body while running, coupled with a remarkable stamina. Number 31. In September 2007, Kennel Club Art Gallery hosted its 12th exhibition titled The Saluki and Art. The exhibition showcased a variety of artworks, including terracotta and bronze pieces, contemporary art, and trophies from Saluki breed clubs. Number 32. In 2014, a DNA study on the AMY2B gene, crucial for starch digestion, found that the Saluki, historically bred in the Fertile Crescent, where agriculture originated, possesses 29 copies of the gene. In comparison, dingoes and wolves had two copies, and the Siberian Husky had three to four copies. This adaptation indicates the Saluki's ability to exploit a starch-rich diet. Alright guys, now which of these Saluki facts intrigued you the most? Please let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.